In gastroscopy, we're looking at the horse's stomach. As you can see, we need a very long gastroscope. It's three meters long. We insert the gastroscope up the nostril. Again, we go at the low, what's known as the ventral meatus, which is at the bottom, that's what ventral means, and meatus, which means space of the nostril. We go up into the back of the throat, and then we get the horse to swallow that gastroscope, and we gently push the scope down into the stomach. And then we can have a very good look around to see if there are any abnormalities there. It is absolutely imperative that the horse has been starved for long enough. We recommend that horses are starved for 18 hours. That means that the stomach is empty. If the horse is eaten, then we can't see anything at all, and the whole exercise has been a bit of a waste of time. And we will always be able to tell whether you've starved your horse or not, because we can see the food that's in the stomach. Once we have got into the stomach, we inflate that into the stomach with air, because the stomach, when it's um, in its normal state, is actually quite collapsed, and you can't see very much. So we actually put air within the uh, stomach itself, a bit like a balloon, that actually expands the stomach and allows us to navigate around the stomach wall, which is what we need to do to get to certain areas, and allows us clear, a clear visual inspection of the stomach lining. Once we've finished looking at the stomach, we then remove that air and gently come out of the stomach. And then we've finished our examination.